There are two words that you often find in the discussions about self-driving cars, autonomous and automated. These words have different meanings depending on who uses them, and the meanings change with time. Sometimes they're used interchangeably, however, they do imply something slightly different. Let's look at the etymology. The word automation comes from the Greek automaton, which meant something that acts by itself. People called automata those mechanical devices that could recreate complex motions that were mechanically stored. There are examples of such devices created millennia ago, but I will give you a more recent example. 100 years ago, automatic pianos or pianolas were something common in the West. The music was encoded in perforated papers that would be read mechanically. Each hole corresponded to a key that would be pressed. Eventually, the word automated was used to describe manufacturing machines that always repeat the same motion. This word has a very industrial flavor to it. The other word, autonomous, means literally something that has its own laws, in the sense that it is self-governing. This suggests something that does not follow predefined steps, but rather it has some internal laws or principles or goals that it must achieve. The actions that are chosen are those that achieve the goals, given the current scenario. In the field of robotics, we talk about autonomous robots, exactly to make the distinction with respect to the previous generation of machines. Another word we use is embodied autonomy, which clarifies that the systems we're interested in are those that have a body, they are embodied. These are systems that interact with the real world, as opposed to a virtual world. What does robot mean? Robot comes from the Czech word robota, which means forced labor. Robots are machines that work for us. I would not say they're forced, because they don't have any choice, or the ability to choose, or the consciousness to understand their place in the world. The way that robotics contributes to society is by creating machines that can do the dull, dirty, and dangerous work that humans should not do. When we say robot, classically we mean but fixed machines, like industrial manipulators, as well as those robots that move in an environment, like a vacuum cleaner, a drone, or the micro-robots that one day will be in your guts fixing you up. For moving robots, we use the word vehicle, which comes from Latin. A vehicle is something that moves and carries something else, like people or cargo. Now, when regular people say autonomous vehicles, they mean self-driving cars. However, for the roboticist, also a drone and a vacuum cleaner are autonomous vehicles. The reality is that the concept we are going to talk about in this course can be applied to any autonomous vehicle, not just cars. I presented to you the consistent nomenclature that we will follow. We define automation, autonomy, robot, and vehicle. There are other words that we need to define, such as intelligence and intelligent, but those merit a longer discussion.